guys and welcome to the application tutorial called smart app protector so this is my phone which is Samsung Galaxy S2 and I hope you have seen my unboxing and the review small review anyway review of uh, Samsung Galaxy S2 and its features I like and uh, so right now I'm giving you some tips and tricks about the software which I include in my phone which I use in my phone so um, one of the best softwares I really ha I right now having it is the Smart App Protector, which um, which I'm I'm actually um, uh, locked the phone, which is a Smart App Protector. That means uh, you're protecting your softwares and your phone with the lock, which is a Smart App Protector. Let me um, let me um, open my uh, <laughs> phone with my keys. Which uh, I usually tap in. Okay, the first letter is four, the second letter is one, and uh, I hope you can see the third and the fourth one. So right now this thing is open. So this is the software. These are the softwares which I add on um, uh, Smart App Protector. Right now it's running pretty much good the software is excellent if you want to add a speci uh, specific software or specific settings on your phone or any specific folders on your phone what you do in e what you need to do is just add click the add button and it will show you the the softwares um, uh, which is um, currently uh, installed on your on your computer or uh, sorry on your mobile so right now I'm going to choose a uh, camera okay I'm going to choose camera and I'm going to add this one click add so right now camera is added let me see where it is uh, camera yeah there you go camera application is added when I click on that it will ask me do you want to delete this app <laughs> if I say okay it will delete the it, it will delete the app app from the smart app protect not from the phone so right now I'm going to I'm going to click cancel because I want to uh, I want to lock the camera when I'm not using the phone okay if somebody else is using the phone see the thing is uh, you or usually use your Google account your Facebook account all your sometimes your uh, what your 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 credit card details and all your wallet details and all you will uh, keep up in the phone but whenever your friends might see all these things whenever your friends might use your Facebook account you know what happens when our account will go into some friends which you know usually don't now respect us don't really friendly to us <laughs> maybe some burglars so we really want to protect our applications on our phones so this thing is a perfect one for that so um, okay, I have added um, camera to the sections and then go to the settings from the key, then check log type, which is a password or pattern or password character or gesture. You can select even uh, any one of these things. Right now, what I'm doing is um, I'm uh, taking the password number, which is my, I have already used it, which is my good thing, and the password, uh, <laughs> sorry, my bad, <laughs> password is that. The password hint is you can uh, always. Uh, I will <laughs> I will hide my password in that <laughs> in the editing. Don't don't be silly. Okay, so leave all these settings like that. Okay, then mm. tap back. Then take this N symbol settings. Then go there. And uh, if you want to uh, use the default settings, just click the default settings or use the customer settings which we have done on the other page then if you want to click the end lock that means uh, your phone your phone's default lock will be will not be using the pattern lock of Samsung Galaxy or your Android phone will not be using instead this a uh, smaller protectors uh, your same number lock will be using so right now mine is on uh, you can simply check it off then click on when you cl first time when you click on it will ask for your email id because your your comp your phone will be completely locked if you if you um, if you uh, if you forget your uh, what your password it will message it will mail you uh, some hints or some maybe your password itself into that email id so you can do that so that's how we do it and just um, Okay, then what? Then it will be like um, this red button. 
and uh, just click yeah, and make it to green okay and what we do is uh, we'll go to the home screen and we will um, take back and we can see smart app protector protector service is running okay we'll click that application and um, it will ask that enable app lock okay and click that and your application will be running which which is the green lock you can see the green lock okay if your application is not running disable app lock okay uh, it lasts for the password let me check it okay the smart app protectors uh, that uh, lock will be the gray one okay see the gray one when the app is running it will be uh, green one see that's the change of it okay whenever the application is running right now camera is locked let me see if I click what happens the camera I click suddenly it asks me for my password okay if I don't know it I might be using the camera like that maybe my messaging also is locked let me see yes and my internet might be locked yes Play Store might be locked. You see, yes, and uh, contacts, absolutely, and the phone, no, yeah, 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 it's also, and the messenger, it's also locked. Okay, then what is there? Let me see. S planner, I'm not using it. I don't have anything on S planner or the calculator. Let me see if that's locked. It's not. See, that thing is working. S planner, that's locked. Uh -huh. the gallery that's two is locked so that's how you do it okay when you want to use your own just go to smart double protector disable app lock and then tap in your password it will unlock the service and then you press the camera voila you go into the camera okay that's how you take a picture and thank you so much for watching this i hope you have enjoyed this video and if you have any sort of any comments or if you need any help just um, send me a message i'll help you right away and uh, come back for more details about the, the new softwares and all